Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I have a new video for you guys. First, before I even start, I want to say happy Thanksgiving to everybody. I will be uploading this video on Thanksgiving day. So just wanted to go ahead and wish you guys nothing but the best. Sending lots of hugs to you guys. And for today's video, I'm going to be doing a sticker slash stationery haul. I have quite a bit of things. I don't think you guys really can see all the orders that i have here but i have quite a ton just from either past months purchases after i filmed my last sticker haul to i believe i got packages this past week so i'm going to show it all just so i can go ahead and organize it and start using it in my plan with me so i am super excited because i already know that you guys are going to love every single thing so of course if you guys have any questions about the shops that i'm going to talk about make sure to check the links down below i will go ahead and link every single shop that i mentioned today so let's go ahead and get started Started. I'm gonna get myself situated here and see what I want to start with. Okay, so I decided to start with this stack, which is already a lot. Okay, so I'm not going to start obviously in the order that I purchased them, but my first order is from Sadie Stickers. As you guys know, I have been using her monthly kits every single month since um, the start of the new Erin Condren planner. Her kits don't go necessarily along with the Erin Condren colors, which is completely fine, but let me go ahead and show you guys. I just thought it was super cute. As you guys can see, all of these stickers are foiled. I have dipped a lot into foil um, these past couple of months, and I am not mad about it at all. So this is just how the monthly butte looks. There's a ton of different pages. You even get some sidebar pieces and some scripts and some date dots. That is for the first little part i do also like to purchase the notes pages sticker sheet so that is how this looks it corresponds to the monthly view on but for the new Erin Condren notes pages so those are the first two things that i got next i also got i believe i purchased this on a two dollar tuesday first i wanted to get this bottom washi overlay it just has cute little hearts i believe yeah i got all these in rose gold so that's what i got i also went ahead and purchased two of the pinks that she had available so i got the um date covers the little layering sampler oh you can see it's so much better there and then the bow headers so i got all of these in rose gold so that's the hot pink i believe and this is just the medium pink i bought some valentine's day kits that i thought would go perfectly with this which i am i think i'll show it right next after this one so i got the medium pink and the same exact thing that i purchased for the hot pink and the headers and then i also went ahead and got these um, rose gold heart dates to go on top of the date covers so that is what i got from Sadie Stickers. I believe that's the only order I have of her. Next up, I don't want to spend too, too much time because I have quite a bit of things to show you guys. Next up, I have Scribble Prints Co., which I actually posted a picture of what I was going to get. As you guys know, her kits are more on the bigger side and I don't end up using every single sticker because I do, I do have the hourly planner, but I plan on using the leftover stickers for either my personal planner or i do have another planner coming which you guys will eventually see a video of so i'm not 100 percent sure on the name of this but if this does not describe me i don't know what does as you guys know i love cherry so so much and this just screamed my name all over it so it comes with a little munchkin sampler and i did just get the mini kit so you have the full boxes square boxes a lot of the sidebar pieces. I love these colors. Some deco, work labels, squared off labels. Oh, I love this little movie marquee, weekend script. And then you have the bottom washi and date covers. And that is what I got. And then aside from that, I also wanted to get some extra labels. So this is just some extra labels that you're able to purchase with any of the collections that she has. Just because I end up using these for whenever I upload videos, so I wanted to get that. And then last but not least, I got this little freebie, which I feel like I have in two different colors, so I'm super glad that I ended up getting the red one because red is my favorite color. So that was what I got from Scribble Prints Co. Next up... Let's see. This is a new shop to me, which is called Paper Shire. She has the cutest things. And she gives you a pretty good amount of freebies. So this was one of the freebies that I got, which is like perfect. 
especially for decorating like Thanksgiving. Definitely will be using that for my Thanksgiving spread. And then this was the 10 euro, I believe, freebie, the little bunnies. So all these have been freebies, guys. I haven't purchased one of these. Oh, so cute. 20 um, euro freebie. And then these are so cute. So um, I wanted to get the ones that resembled me the most. So as you guys know, I do have red hair. And although this is not the reddest of hair i do think it looks very much like me so i wanted to get a couple of sheets you guys will see so this one is the christmas activities one i believe she has different colored girls so make sure you check her out if you guys would like to have any cute girls in your planners then i got the together one isn't this so cute i love it i got the cooking one because i definitely want to meal prep as much as i can before my sister's wedding i need to eat a lot better than i'm eating right now I got the half box drinks. Me and Paul don't go out for drinks a lot, but I thought that it'd be cute just to mark that whenever we did. Then I got these, which I think this sheet alone is so cute. This is the pink office little sheet. Then I got the burger box, which I thought would be perfect for whenever I got in and out. Speaking of me eating bad. <laughs> Then I got one of these fold notebooks. I have used something like this from One Spread With Love in the past, so I thought it'd be super cute for any spreads that had pink in it. So I got one of these. I also got the beauty routine ones, especially because I want to start taking a lot better care of my skin. I got some of these floral little YouTube icons. I got some printers. Definitely needed these. Some hot wings. <laughs> I asked Paul if he thought it was a good idea to purchase these, and he said yes, so got those. Then I got some of the Boss Lady. I just think these are so dainty and cute, and I just love them, so love these. Got these sticker cutting machines. And then last but not least, I got the donut box. I don't think you guys know this, but I really love donuts. Um, I don't eat them much because I know they're not the best thing for you, but I thought that it would be cute to mark whenever I got some. So that was my order from Paper Shire. Super, super excited about these and can't wait to put them on my planner. Next up, we have a new shop to me as well, and it is the Crafty Banana. A lot of you guys may or may not know the Crafty Banana, but she had the most perfect kit for me, especially in this season, because I've been watching this show like a mad woman. This is the cutest little stamp with the background of the sticker kit. Okay, let me show you guys. <laughs> and if you still have not guessed it, it is her Gilmore Girls kit. Guys, when I saw this, I think one of my subscribers actually tagged me on her post. I died. You guys don't know how much I've been really binging Gilmore Girls and I know that show has been out for so long. I have seen a couple of episodes but I've never watched it the way that I'm watching it now which is like from the very beginning seeing everything and how it unfolds and I just love it so much so when I saw this kit on her shop I picked it up. This is how the full boxes look. I love this whole scene of Stars Hollow. So cute. Rory, lower life. Okay if you guys have not seen Gilmore Girls then you guys are not gonna know where these are from but I just got the mini kit and I think yeah this artwork is um, by Fox and Pip. So we have this sheet and then you get the bottom washi and some littles and then this came with the kit as well, a little sampler. And then I went ahead and purchased this a la carte, I don't know if I purchased this, I might have purchased it but this is just a little mini scene of Stars Hollow, love that. I purchased the date covers just to add a little bit more to the kit. I think I might end up using this in a vertical layout just so I can utilize all of these glitter headers. So got the glitters, the glitter sampler, and that was my order from the Crafty Banana. Love that. Next, we have an order from Paper Milk. I absolutely love her packaging. I love her stickers. They're super cute, and I love how she wrote out my name in calligraphy. I believe she does this for every single order, so... If you love that, make sure you check Denise out. I think I might have gotten this right after I finished filming my last sticker haul. So this is just the postcard. It says, I love you a lot. That's so cute. And then this is my little freebie that I got. Super cute. And these 
were the stickers. So I got the happy little Maros because I think I have the little the sad ones. So I decided to get the happy ones as well. This is something I've been looking forward to doing. Um, these are just skincare products. Like I mentioned, I want to take better care of my skin. And what way to do so than to plan for it or use cute stickers in my planner. <laughs> so these are really cute um, skincare products. I also got iced coffees. Tell me these are not the cutest iced coffees you've ever seen. So cute. Um, also got burgers and fries with some more burgers and fries stickers. <laughs> got the This Is Fine Little Maru and Flames. I think this is going to be really funny to use in my planner whenever, you know, those days come. And then I got some for YouTube and the holiday mood, which I can definitely use to either mark like Vlogmas videos or anything like that. So really really happy with my paper and milk corner next up i have a new shop to me actually all these yeah a new shop to me which i got introduced by in kiera's planner if you guys i don't know if you guys follow her she i think her name before on youtube and instagram was paper princess i think that's what it was i believe she changed it just a couple of months ago and i have been super obsessed with her plan with me's um she's been doing plan with for years but she always speaks about paper muse crafts and i decided to give paper muse crafts a go so let me go ahead and show you guys what it is that i have here i believe she was having some sort of two dollar tuesday sale the time that i purchased this i think so her stickers are also foiled and this is just a freebie that we got and then let's see i wanted to purchase these um headers and i believe she has headers for every collection that she offers in her shop but i wanted to get them because i thought they'd be perfect to put on my sidebar as you guys know i don't use these headers throughout my whole week and just on my sidebar so i thought it'd be perfect to match to some of my christmas kits that i have coming up so i have these and then i also have these which i believe this is from you can see from the freedom kit and from the jingle bells kit but i just thought it looked nice with a couple of spreads that i have in mind so i got those first i always see her raving about them so definitely wanted to get a couple and then aside from that i got her chiller tuesdays which she was doing buffalo plaid and at, at the time that i was um looking through her shop so i hope you guys can tell but these are heart foiled icons and they are on that buffalo plaid sticker paper so i got um these as well as these little bow headers that i thought would be perfect to put on my sidebar once again so these so i got them in red buffalo plaid in green buffalo plaid and in your standard black and white buffalo plaid i hope you can see that really hard to see on camera but they're super cute and i can't wait to use these i think i'm gonna start using them in december yeah for my christmas spreads the next shop i've also seen her use quite a lot and the shop is called tasseled planner i believe she closed her shop and i got a couple of like grab bags and that was pretty much all that i could get which i'm kind of happy because it was at a discounted price so this is what i had in the little grab bag i believe this was like ten dollars I want to say for 10 sheets i'm not sure but you have these i don't know if you can tell these foiled headers these foiled headers then we have some relax little icons office supplies these are cute to mark important things some of these boxes which actually match this it's cute some of these washing machines with the little foiled hearts these are cute bibles oh i love this these are really cute so all these are foiled so they have little dainty bows little bobby pins little ballet shoes which i'm probably never going to use so I might end up giving that away wine glasses love these Last but not least was the little teas, which I think these are perfect. I will be utilizing probably most of these with the exception of the ballet ones, but I really like this and I'm kind of sad that she's no longer um, open, but hopefully she comes back. So that was my order from Tassel Planner. And then next up, I have something 
from Planner Press. If you guys don't know about Planner Press, I actually just found them a couple of weeks ago. They sell dividers among other things to set up your rings. Planner, I believe, but that's mainly what it is that I bought. So let me go ahead and show you guys because I am very, very excited about this. I think I'm only going to show you part of my order because I do plan on showing the other part in a separate video. So let me go ahead and see this. So this is a little journaling card that came with my order. It just says it's autumn. And then what I got, I can show you guys, is these cute little dividers. I believe this is the diamond one that she has. She has different materials that she can make into dividers, but I just purchased these from my micro happy planner. I made them top tabs. And then I purchased these stickers. They are foiled, which you can put into the little tabs. So I have quite a few to choose from and these are one, two, three, four, five. So there's five tabs with the little stickers put on top. Super cute. I can't wait to utilize this. Um, I've actually been using my micro hobby planner a lot. I, I love it so much so I thought it'd be cute to get some little dividers for it. So that is what I got from Planner Press. Next we have one of my favorite shops which is the Fox and Pip. First I got one of these vellums. I think she came out with this like a couple of months ago, but she had leftover ones and I did get the one in rose gold. I think she has a whole tutorial on her Instagram to see how you can make this into sort of sticker pockets. So I wanted to purchase one and create one because I do have a laminator that I can laminate it in. And yeah, so I got one of these. This is the cute freebie. So it has a couple of the luxe items, little planner club sticker. And I really like that. I'm going to use that for um, the new year. I got these little foiled bow flags. Let me go ahead. And... They are on like pink paper. So I thought these would be cute to mark things with. Also got more of the happy minis, which these fit perfectly in the micro happy planner. So I got some of these YouTube icons some little podcast icons because i've been listening to quite a bit of podcasts lately some of these little inbox ones i have these in bigger in a bigger size but i thought it'd be cute to put in my micro happy planner so i got one of these some credit cards or just cards and then i got these which are the notebook page reminder i really like these to signify whenever i start a new course in my interpretation program so i decided to pick up these because I just ran out and that was my small order from Fox and Pip. Next up really quick I'm going to show you guys my two orders from Simply Gilded. The first one is my subscription box for October I want to say. Yeah October. Okay so really quick um, it comes with a cute little enamel pen. It's a little bunny there. We have some vellum and acetate. Mini sheets. One of these sticky notes black ones of course a journaling card um i believe yeah the whole theme of the box was called folktale we have one of these v6 dot grid blackout journals and the reason everything is black is because i think she ends up giving you i'll show you guys right now these were the stickers that came in there cute with little bow seals and this is the pouch that we got for last month so let me show you guys the washi. For the pens, we got this hot pink jelly roll pen. And then this is so cute to me, guys. So happy about this. This is a black gel ink pen with a ton of little bows. Super cute. And then for the washi. For the washi, this time around, we got five of them. And these are it. So we have the hot pink kind of foiled ones and then other ones that go along with the graphics in this kit. So I think this is really cute, a cute box. I never want to miss out on the boxes. I'm sometimes on the verge of canceling it, but then I see how cute the next box up is and I don't end up canceling it. And I'm just glad that I haven't canceled it. I've been having it since February and I've loved every single washi that we get every single month. Although I don't end up utilizing every single thing. Um, I do like it and I do think it is worth the price that you pay. So that was from my first Simply Gilded order. And then my last Simply Gilded order, I 
purchase some really festive washies. The journaling card that I got just says happy holidays. It's cute. I ended up buying some bow seals. The painterly sort of buffalo plaid colors. They, are with, they have gold foil. For my washi, I first got this one, which is a light kind of periwinkle blue, sort of. Um, and I thought it'd be perfect to pair with any of like the snowy kits I plan on using. It's so cute. Love it. So I got this. And then the last couple of ones, let me show you. So these, as you guys can see, are very, very Christmassy. I love them so much. We got the red with gold foil and the dark hunter green with gold foil as well. I ended up purchasing a dark green last time, but it had silver foil. So I thought I would cover all of my bases by purchasing this one in gold foil. And of course, to go along with these, I ended up purchasing the 5mm version of those colors. Because as you guys know, I use these as a header. For my spread so that was my orders from simply gilded next up we're getting right into the next thing um i have an order from two little bees i'm super excited for this order as well as i think i have another one coming up first and foremost i'll go ahead and show you guys this i got a thanksgiving hobonichi kit because i noticed that i didn't have any and i just think this is super cute as you guys can see i got the two pages we have a full box this is thankful some washi, some bottom washi, a couple of labels, weekly box, headers, more boxes, habit trackers, square boxes. I usually use these for like my meals, more washi, some dots, flags, and date covers. So this is the little thankful kit, super cute. And then last but not least, I purchased a kit for December, which I will be using on my channel. This is the journaling card that we got, which feels really nice and sturdy. I love this. This is cute. I can definitely use it in one of my planners. Where is it this way? It's this way. <laughs> That's cute. Okay, so we have that. And the kit that I got, I, be I believe this kit was called Noel. I'm not 100% sure, but I just thought it was so cute. Um, you have a ton of boxes, so I definitely think I'll be using the vertical layout for this kit. I love this, which if you guys remember the little headers that I got from Paper Muse Crafts, I can definitely use these with this kit. So I'm super excited for that. Um, these are So these are all the full boxes that we got, some labels at the bottom, flags, date covers, deco, weekend script, sidebar items, more boxes, quarter and half boxes. And then we have some headers. This is cute too, it matches the other one. And some bottom washi. So that was the Noel kit, which I'm super excited to use in my planner. I always think two little beast kits are so cute. And I'm, I'm excited to be able to use this on my planner, finally. So that was my two little bees order. Next up, we have Sticky Essentials. I believe I purchased this. I purchased this during her birthday sale and it took quite a long time although the processing time was within that so it took about like a month for it to get to me which is totally fine but I'm really glad that it got to me the time that it got to me because one of these is my Thanksgiving kit that I will be using um, later on this week on my channel so I think first I will start with the first kit if you guys don't know about sticky essentials she does um, I believe all her kits are on premium matte I want to say I have used I have used her stickers on my channel in the past. Yeah, this is premium map. I really like how that spread turned out. So I decided to get this one, which is called Flights Not Feelings, just for whenever I decide to take a trip. I do think I might take a trip sometime in 2020. So I thought it would be perfect to take this. I just love the full boxes, love the marble in the back because I have quite a bit of marble things that I can use. So I got the mini kit. She's having a pretty good sale. Her birthday sale was really good. And then all these sheets, some deco, sidebar items, flags. And then last but not least, you have the bottom washi and the date covers. So that was my first kit from Sticky Essentials. And then the second kit that I purchased was, like I mentioned, one for Thanksgiving. 
I really like this, especially because of the pumpkin pie, but it's just super colorful and it's not too, too orange, I want to say. I'm really sorry, but you guys can't hear the train. It's going crazy out there. So this is the full box page. This page. More of this sidebar items, deco, and the bottom washi and date covers. I really like this full box. Meal plan, thankful and grateful. This is so cute. I love it. <laughs> so that was my order for sticky essentials. And then next up, we're almost done here, guys. Don't worry. I have one of my favorite shops, as you guys know, Once More With Love. I'm not sure when I purchased this at this time, to be honest, but um, I did get a bunch of holiday-themed items, so let's go ahead and get started with this. Look at this little journaling card. It just says queen. I love it. <laughs> That's so cute. Okay, so I got two freebies. This is the freebie that I also got from Scribble Prince Co, but they do have them in several foils. So this is the holographic one, which is cute. I also got this freebie. This is for the month of October, so that's when I bought this. Cute. And then the sheets that I got are so cute, guys. I got this Holidays With You sheet that I thought would be perfect, especially this one. This is gonna be me and Paul when we go Christmas shopping. <laughs> That's gonna be me. And that's gonna be Paul. <laughs> that's so cute. I love this so much. Um, I also went ahead and got the Christmas countdown. This is in the traditional colors. I think I have the pastel one from last year that I never ended up using. But I wanted to get this because I thought this would go perfect with my holiday kits that I have in mind. So I have this. Next, I got the 2020 New Year's Deco. Cute. I got the Holiday Shopping Madness, which is, is going to start tomorrow, Black Friday. <laughs> I have the I Had a Bad Day, which I was running out of. Some of these, which I love to use this in my shop, Hobo. This is the Hobo Munchkin sort of checklist. I got one of these. I got some Birthday Deco. And next, I got some Winter Deco that I thought would be nice. I think we might end up going up to big bear up in the mountains where it does snow with my family i'm not 100 percent sure but if we ended up going i just wanted to use this deco and then last but not least i got the holiday doodle deco so i have a ton of holiday stickers that i definitely want to use up like but isn't this sheet just the cutest sheet you've ever seen oh my god there's two of those oh there's actually that's cute the mistletoe guys the mistletoe that's so cute okay that's my order from once more with love and then last but not least i wanted to save the kit that i'll be using for my birthday week which if you guys don't know my birthday is february 27th so definitely wanted to get something cute and special for that so let me go ahead and show you guys this is from a shop called simply watercolor co which you guys have probably heard of before I recently just got this actually in the mail, so I'm super excited that I get to um, show this on camera. But I ended up getting a couple of things. Let me see. I think she was having a $2 Tuesday, or I don't know how she calls it, because different shops call them different things, so I'm not 100% sure. This is what I got as my freebie. She is known for the washi half boxes, I believe, so I got that. As well as this other freebie, which has kind of that blue foil. I don't know if, I don't know if you guys can see that. I got some overlays. I'm not 100% sure if I purchased this. I want to say I didn't. So I got this and then this little sampler. I'm not sure if I did, honestly. Um, I know I did buy this one, which was the Valentine's Day sort of foil deco. I love the little kisses and everything else. I think it's really cute. So I got that. Let me go ahead and show you guys my kid, which I've talked about um, quite a bit if you guys have been following me, but if not, this is the kit that I will be using for the week of my birthday. Um, as you guys can see, it's very Louis Vuitton inspired. I feel like everybody has been getting inspired by Louis Vuitton lately, and so have I. You guys will kind of see a little bit um, in the future. So I just wanted to get this really cute kit, which was in collaboration with Annie Plants. So this is how the full boxes look. They are foiled. I believe I got the rose gold foil. I love this. It's an add to cart kind of day. So we have the full boxes. This is the mini kit. 
I end up getting many kits to be honest all the time because I never end up using all of the stickers whenever I get like full kits and they are cheaper. This is the bottom washi, half boxes, some headers, and then stuff for the sidebar. So all of your boxes, habit trackers, any ton of Louis planners, and pens. So, so cute. So that was the kit that I purchased. And aside from this, she did have sort of other collab items with Annie Plan. So I decided to purchase the pink Louis sampler. So I got this one to go along with my kit. This is in rose gold. It just has, as you guys can see, some dots, layering items, icons, date covers, and two boxes. So I got that in rose gold. And then I also did get it in gold just to have. And I really like how pink looks with gold foil. So I got that. And then last but not least, I also got her washi. I believe she had this brown Louis pattern as well as the gray one. Now, if she had the pink one, I would definitely have bought that, but I just thought it would be really cute um, to mark a couple of things with it or just use it around my different planners. So with that being said, that is all that I have for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed every single thing. I know this probably was a really long video, so thank you so much to everybody who has stuck until the very end. If you guys enjoyed, please don't forget to give this video a huge thumbs up as well as subscribe to my channel if you guys are not subscribed already for more content and hopefully I'll get to see you guys on my next one. I hope you guys have a happy Thanksgiving. Bye bye.